Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying two cookies from the Private Selection uh, Collection. This is a Kroger brand. Uh, I have the brown butter toffee cookies. They have salted caramel pretzels. And Rachel told me about these, so thank you very much, Rachel. She sent me a picture on Instagram, and I really appreciate that. Uh, they were $3.49 a box. Um, and there are six cookies in the container. <coughs> so six cookies, $3.49. One of the brown butter toffee cookies is 130 calories. And I'm going to let Kevin open this while I'm read about them let's see it says private selection brown butter toffee cookies are rich crumbly and bursting with toffee flavor made with a caramel cookie base and loaded with crunchy toffee bits they are baked in small batches then drizzled with creamy white chocolate for an irresistible indulgence so we have a caramel cookie base with toffee bits and white chocolate. Sounds good. Good thing you have plenty to read because that's awful. Right? Looks like opening up and cutting a mylar balloon with your fingers. Okay, so they come in two trays like this. They smell really good. I don't leave them in the wrapping because it's really it's hard, hard to get it to back in. Back, yes. <laughs> so the white chocolate is on the bottom oh. and it is drizzled, drizzled on the top. And these are a crunchier. Yes, these are called uh, rich, rich and crumbly. They're still relatively soft. Mm-hmm. They're not near like a like, like a, a Keebler chips ahoy. Uh, chips ahoy. Yeah, they're not near as crispy as that at all. That um white coating, whatever it is. It's got a waxy. It's white chocolate. It has a waxy feel to it. Mm -hmm. It's white chocolate. A lot of times they don't use, they use a confection. This is actually white chocolate. I like that. Mm -hmm. I like good. that. I that think it's a good easy. cookie. Um, I would not pay $3.49 again for six cookies. Even no. though it's good, I have had other caramel cookies that um because it, the, you do taste the caramel mm -hmm. but i've had other caramel cookies that are um better and cheaper but it's, but it's this it's supposed to be like a toffee kind of yeah flavor. i didn't get toffee i didn't really get toffee either no i got caramel and i got the the white chocolate but not yeah. toffee they're good i like the i like the, the i like the flavors mm -hmm. but like i said for that much money it's just a lot of money to pay for six cookies they have to be something special or they need to be giant to justify that amount of money. That's just a lot of money to me for six cookies. Okay, these are salted caramel pretzel. Salted caramel pretzel cookies are rich, crumbly, and bursting with sweet and salty flavor. Made with crunchy pretzel pieces and a touch of salt, these caramely cookies are baked in small batches, then drizzled with chocolate for an irresistible indulgence. So these have should have chocolate, yeah, Chocolate oh, on the, the top and but yeah, this these look really good. So they're gonna have pretzel. And yeah, they're they're kind of they're not as hard as like a chips of oil. Pretzel, like salt, and caramel. Those are much softer than that. Mmm. Now see, I don't like that. Really? Yeah, what kind of chocolate is that? Is it a darker chocolate? It didn't say. That tastes like a darker chocolate. It is dark chocolate. Mm -hmm. It didn't say dark chocolate in the description, but in the ingredients, it specifically says dark chocolate. Now, these are 120 calories. If you want that, you can have them. see? I don't like them. I like that. But I don't think it tastes anything like what they described. Um, I get the salt from the pretzels. Mm -hmm. I don't get caramel though, and I think my problem is that it's dark chocolate, so I don't. I, don't, I get the salt. It's got the bitterness, or yeah, I get the salt. But that's it. The pretzels are kind of 
like stale pretzels though. Chewy. They, yeah, they don't have that good crisp, like a fresh pretzel. He's right. So uh, that that texture throws me off a bit. Mm -hmm. They are chewy pretzels. Yeah. Absolutely, they're not. The flavor is okay. I, I, I can see a little bit of the caramel flavor in there, just a touch. It reminds me of a raw chocolate chip cookie dough. That's yeah. what it tastes okay. like to me. With dark chocolate chips. With dark chocolate, yeah, using dark chocolate. Mm -hmm. um, I do taste the salt. Uh, I did not get the caramel as much in those as I did in the brown butter toffee. Yeah, I agree. Um, but I would not spend, I, I know I'm hung up on the price, but that's just me. I, there's it's a lot for this much, this few cookies. Yeah, there's so many cookies that I like more that are cheaper and you get a lot more cookies in the package. You know, you can buy a package of great value cookies and you get like 20 of them in the package and they taste better than these. Yeah. And, and I know that private selection is a uh, supposed to be a better quality. That might be so, but these in particular just aren't for me as far, it's just the price doesn't match what you get, I don't right. think. I agree. Sometimes, um, Sometimes the it, the price uh, does match what you get and it makes it worth it. You're like, yes, I would totally spend three dollars and forty nine cents on right. those because it it it, ma it matches. These just don't. Yeah. The the it's flavor and the the size and and everything does not match the price that they're asking for these. No, I agree. So um, although I like both of them, I would not actually buy them again. No. Uh, now, out of the two, somebody will probably say, which one? If I one? had to pick one, because the they are butter. good. Um, I'd pick the brown butter. You would pick the brown butter. Yeah, I didn't like the dark chocolate or that soft texture of those. Yeah. Um, hmm. I think I would pick the salted caramel would pretzel. You? Yeah. I mean, I like them equally. Honestly, sometimes there's a clear winner with these. I just like them both equally. So. Um, yeah, and we have tried uh, the other two private uh, selection uh, cookies as well. So you might want to check out that video because those were soft baked cookie cookies, and those were uh, lemon and uh, dulce de leche. So if if you had all four of those cookies sitting here and you could only pick one, which one would you pick? The lemon. The lemon. I yeah. would too. I would pick the lemon definitely. So um, yeah, three forty nine is a lot to pay. So if you only can pay it one time, I would get the lemon if you like lemon. No, yeah. So uh, I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.